everyone. Um, it is Friday. Yes, I have a hand in my sock, or a sock in my hand because I was just doing laundry and my husband has a hole in this sock and I still washed it. I didn't realize it. Um, when you have a hole this big in your sock, you might as well just throw it away. I'm back from the grocery store. I don't really have much proof right now except for asparagus sitting there. Um, all the other groceries are over that way. So I just was eating a banana and the texture was a little weird. And so I made this, and I know it doesn't really look that good on camera, but um, it's banana, frozen grapes, and a little bit of peanut butter, or like a fair amount of peanut butter. So there's not much in there, obviously, but that's just because there wasn't much banana. But this tastes really good, so I'm probably going to make this again, honestly. bathroom and um, I have these new towels out and then there's this blue one which isn't looking very blue but it is it's so cute um, so the bathroom's coming together I've kind of thought about hanging something up in here since every room is just so white so I have this sign that says loves patient loves kind blah 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 and um, it has this blue in it which I think will look nice with that towel and we have other blue towels and stuff and we have that tissue box that's blue so I thought it'd be a really good idea to hang up this sign so I'm going to try and center it somewhere up in here. So I'm going to see like just kind of where a good spot is for it and hang it hopefully. Sunday morning. I know I hardly ever vlog on a Sunday. I think this might be the first time. But I am making chicken in a crock pot. I just put some barbecue sauce on it, but then I took it in a bowl and I heated it up with some brown sugar and other spices um, just to kind of make it my own and I think it tastes a lot better than just how it is out of the bottle. But that's my preference, not something you have to do. You can see me, hi! Um, but the chicken is cooking. Um, I have it on 10 hours, so um, it's going to be one of those very low, slow kind of things, but hopefully it turns out well. And then I have sweet potatoes. I love very few foods more than sweet potatoes. Um, so I'm going to make fries out of these. And that'll be our dinner tonight. Oh, and I have asparagus in the fridge. And I might cook up some asparagus as well because it's delicious. Everyone, so it is almost 10 o'clock and I am... Oh, my phone's going off. Probably just my husband. Um... A friend of mine is coming to visit me today, and so she's on her way right now, and we're going to go to the mall later and check it out. It's like an outdoor mall, so I'm really excited. I've never been there, um, but it looks really nice. And so I'm going to try and put this sign up. Um, it's upside down, but it says, Home Sweet Home. I want to hang it up above our bed, so I might work on that a little bit here while I wait for my friend to get here. It'll be about half an hour still, or 20 minutes, so I'm just going to try and hang that up. So I only got two things on our shopping experience. I wanted to get so many more, but like I'm trying to be good about spending money, and by that I mean not spending too much money. But um, first of all, I'm gonna start off with my friend got me this from Bed or from Bar not Bed Bath and Beyond, not Barnes and Noble, Bath and Body Works. It's the leaves, excuse me, scent portable refill thing um, for your car, like how they have little scent things. It's in the scent leaves, and I love that scent, and it's going to be so good. I'm going to put it in my car. Like, I haven't checked mine in a long time, but I'm sure it's run. I think it's run out, and so I'll probably use this one next. I'm so excited. Then I have a caramel one if I can find it somewhere for, like, winter time. Um, the dishwasher is also running, by the way, so sorry that's so loud. But um, the leaves scent is so good. You can kind of smell it from the packaging, like, outside the packaging, and it's so good. I def definitely recommend it. They also have the leaves candle, which is super popular. Um, but what I got was from Forever 21. I got two things, and the first one was a gray cardigan. Um, it's very simple because I I got it because I needed a gray cardigan, <laughs> and uh, it was only $9.90, and it is just simple, cute, and I love it. My other gray cardigan is a little lighter gray than this, but it was getting holes in like the armpit and stuff, and so um, I needed a new one. It's really soft. I mean, it's like decently pretty soft, and it's just super like nice. It's a little thicker, so it like it's good. <laughs> um, and the second thing I got, I'm super excited about. They had this in red as well, and I loved it. But but the red, the small was a little too small for me, and I could not find this dress anywhere else in the store. 
um, to get it in a medium. So I got it in this beautiful greenish color instead. Um, and I tried this one on a medium and it seemed pretty big so I got the small so hopefully it's good. Um, if not I can return it. It's like this. It's like a few minutes away. But um, it is just a simple, it has like a t-shirt type neck style and then it cinches at the waist over here which is so cute and so flattering. And then um, the bottom there's this kind of draping um, and it's just so beautiful. And this is just a really simple cottony dress, um, great for summer or fall for like date nights or something. Um, my husband and I are probably going on a date this week actually, and so I might wear it. What's my hair doing? <laughs> um, I might wear it for our date. We'll see. But it is so so cute, or like Christmas even with a with a cardigan because it's kind of like a green. That would be so cute. And like it'd be really nice for like a statement necklace or something like that. Um, so yeah, I love Forever 21. I haven't shopped there in a long time, but this is so cute. So that's my little mini haul. It is Tuesday, and um, I got groceries, which I have some cold things, so I really need to hurry back to the apartment. And then I came to the dollar store. I ended up getting these flowers, um, which were not a necessity, but they're each a dollar, so it wasn't that bad, or like each bundle is. Um, so I'm excited to make a little bouquet out of those. But I got just like soap and stuff, and then groceries for up north which we are leaving for on Friday so I won't be vlogging much next week probably but if I do get any footage it'll be really cool because it'll be like up north um but I need to hurry back to the apartment I'll talk to you guys soon but um the point is that I'm home uh I've unloaded mostly so I just have like some things sitting out still those are for up north um I have laundry to do and I'm going to film a video so I'm excited I'm going to talk about um snacks that I got for up north ah the camera cord is strapped in the way but I'm really excited. more puppy showers, more muddy buddies. Um, so I have all the ingredients here. I have rice checks and golden grams and um, oh, marshmallows and chocolate chips and all kinds of peanut butter. I just, these two are almost empty, this one and this one, so that's why I have another one out um, and some powdered sugar. So I am just starting to make it. This is the first step and then I have to melt some chocolate and some peanut butter and put that in. We'll put it all in a bag first and then shake it up and then add powdered sugar. It's just, it's really fun. Um, if you guys want to see how to make it, I could do a video, um, just let me know if you want me to, but, um, Hey Kaylee already has a video on it, um, Kaylee Butler, so Hey Kaylee on YouTube, um, and so you can just check that out, I can link that down below as well. Alright, so I've just been putting, um, I combined those, which I already showed you, and now I'm doing a cup of chocolate chips and half a cup of peanut butter, so I'm still working on that, I need another quarter cup. Peanut, or my chocolate and peanut butter mixture, and I added some marshmallows in, so I'm just letting that kind of melt in there a little bit. And then I'm going to add it into my mi dry mixture and then start mixing these two together and then I'll add it into the powdered sugar bag and then carefully um, just shake that and if I have to I'll mix it in again. It is done. So I just, um, once I had it all coated with powdered sugar, I added a cup of mini marshmallows, a cup of golden graham cereal, and half a cup of chocolate chips and that's it. Now I'm just going to put it in a large gallon sized bag and it's ready to go up north. And crackers and um, tuna salad for lunch today. It is so good. So I've just been kind of in a weird funk today um, on Thursday. So I'm kind of just trying to deal with that. My husband and I, this morning when I woke up, I thought we were leaving tonight to go up north because we had changed our minds. We thought tonight we were going to go for sure. And now things are up in the air and I'm not sure what to do so I'm kind of just sitting here. Um, it's kind of why I'm in a funk, I feel like, or part of it, is because I just don't know what to do. I'm like, so I'm just going to sit here and watch YouTube videos and just feel meh and like, you know, not so great, not so bad, but just kind of do nothing because I don't know what to do. So, um, 
Anyway, to snap out of my funk, I made stir fry, which is just noodles and peas basically and ginger and garlic. But it's Thursday and I might be leaving tonight, I might be leaving tomorrow morning. Either way, I'm leaving soon to go up north. So I'm going to end this vlog. I need to start getting ready to go up north whether it's tonight or tomorrow morning because I still haven't packed. <laughs> like I've packed things. I've set aside things, but I haven't packed them. So I need to go figure out if I'm taking a suitcase or multiple bags or what I'm doing for like towels and sheets and those kinds of things. So it's like 1.30. Um, but thanks for watching the vlog. I hope you guys enjoyed and stay tuned for next week's vlog because I hopefully should have some footage from up north. I'm really excited, so stay tuned.